All right, you guys really want to hear this story? If five different people press a one in chat right now, nah, fuck it. There's 14 out. If seven different people right now put a one in chat, I'll tell the story tonight. I need to see that you guys care. Five, oh, that's four. I need to get three more people. Damn. Damn you, Kyle. Damn, that's five. Not near. No, no, I, I'm not that silly. Come on. Just got here. My man just got here. He's like, oh, I want to hear this shit. That's five. Leak, God damn you. That's six. Oh, God. Dirty. That's real dirty. That's real dirty. Oh wait, I should have said a majority. I should have said a majority, so it would have been eight. Damn. All right, here we go. You nasty. All right. The story goes like this. The story is about how sometimes you know you play yourself, and it's also about not invading people's fucking privacy. So here's what happened, right? So the other day, me and Girlie were talking, right? Girlie's like, yo, funny story. This dude I work with was talking to this chick on Snapchat. Turns out that it was a bot. And the bot is now blackmailing him, threatening to expose his nudes for $1,000. I was like, damn, that's stupid. Couldn't be me, you dumb motherfucker. So his friend goes and he goes to his job and he snitches on himself. He snitches on himself that, hey, I sent nudes to a bot, and now the bot's threatening to expose them for $1,000, right? So, in the homie group chat, this spawned an entire discussion of, in 2022, doesn't matter if your dick's on the internet, right? In my opinion, I'm like, listen, first off, you should never put your penis and your face in the same picture. That's just plausible deniability. So, we're, 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 we're talking about it, we're arguing about it, we're laughing about it. <laughs> <laughs> It's a great fucking time, right? Not even 24 hours. Just hit the fast forward button. I'm on the phone with somebody I'm talking to. And they're like, yo, I got a story to tell you. I'm like, okay, go. If it's a 10 inch dick, I'm saying it's mine. <laughs> yo, honestly, honestly, yeah, I ain't gonna lie. If it's a monster, I'm claiming that shit because I know, I know I'm not built like that. And I'm not afraid to say it. But if it's a monster, I'm like, yo, no, no, that's me. I'm like, no, no, no. That's, that's like, hey, hey, hey. Even if it's not me, I'm like, yo, that's all me. Ha, <laughs> flexing. She goes, I got a story to tell. I'm like, all right. She goes, so my phone was open and my friend was watching a video on my phone and you sent me a message and the friend clicked the message. I'm like, uh, okay. They're like, the friend saw all my videos. I'm like, ha, <laughs> okay. And they saw a lot of them. I'm like, okay. And then it hit me like a ton of bricks. I'm like, oh, oh, if they went that far. So the person was telling me what the person saw. And I was like, yo, if they went that far, they went past me. I was included in that. So I was, I was mad. I'm like, yo, what kind of friend would see that you get a message, click on your messages, and then go through your messages? I'm like, yo, that's not your fucking friend. That's an invasion of privacy. That is fucked up looking at your personal shit. In order of being mad, first, I was mad that person's privacy got invaded. Second, I was mad that that person's stuff got leaked. And then third was me. I'm like, oh, shit, there's pictures of me. And there's pictures of me. There's pictures of me, and there's pictures of me. You know what I mean. Listen, you know what the fuck I mean. There's multiple pictures of me. But because I'm smart, because I thought, I thought, son, I think like that. I'm like, yo, I'm not putting my face in the same picture as I put me. Me and me don't belong in the same picture. So there's me, and then there's me. But it's one of those things like, damn, there's both. So it's not hard to connect who belongs to who. So at this point... I'm like, damn, because at first it was all funny games. I was like, damn, somebody went through your phone? Damn, they saw your shit? Damn, that sucks. And I was like, wait, they saw my shit? What the fuck did I do to deserve this? They had to see me in all my glory. And then the thought occurred to me, I'm like, wait a minute. Who are they going to tell? Hmm? Who are you going to tell? How do you explain to somebody, yo, I saw this nigga's dick in a shawty's camera roll? Without getting yourself in trouble. And it's one of those things like, nah, I know you couldn't. I know there's no way you didn't see it. 
I know that's why you ignored it. You were scrolling, scrolling. You was looking for the goods. You wanted to know where all the goods was. And you found me, nigga. You found me. And not just a little bit of me. No, 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 no. I wish there was a little bit of me. If there was a little bit of me, I wouldn't feel so. Actually, no, I'm glad it wasn't a little bit of me. I'm glad there was a lot of me. It was, it was some of the best parts of me, to be fair. You know, but at the same time, it's like, you don't want to be out like that. But in the same breath, I came back to that conclusion. I was like, yo, it's 2022. If you want to slang my shit on the internet, you think I give a fuck? I would just deny that it's me. You, yo, even if I had like, even if I had something that was like a very describer of who it, it was me, I'd be like, that's not me. I would deny that shit to my grave. And last niggas was like, yo, that nigga packing. I'm like, yeah, hey. <laughs> It's me! Damn, nigga! It's me! That's my shit! Y'all like it? You like it? You fuck with it, though? So it's one of those things, like, you went looking for something that wasn't for you, and you got a face full of nasty penis. Bad move, Billy. But it was a funny situation because the person felt really bad. And you know what the best part is? The person didn't have to tell me. They had no obligation to tell me that the leak had happened. But they came to me and they told me, like, look, I got to tell you a story. And it was funny at first. And I was like, oh, shit. And then I started laughing again because I'm like, who this nigga going to tell? They could lie. They could lie and say, oh, they showed me or, oh, it just popped up. But that's not true. But how do you explain you saw another man's dick on somebody's phone you wasn't supposed to be on? Huh? Huh? <laughs> I didn't have to be drunk for this. I would have told y'all this shit sober because it's honestly fucking hilarious. I was mad at first, but then I was like, you know what? There is some pictures of my face and then there's pictures of my peen, but there's no pictures of my face and my peen in the same place. Now, granted, if y'all just saw anything from me from the belly button to the knee, there's no way you're not going to know it's me. You know what I mean? I could lie and say it's not me, but I'm pretty sure you don't know it's me. So it's one of those things where I just had to come to terms. It's like, yeah, you probably saw my shit and my face, but at the same time, who you going to tell? Huh? And if my peen does get out to the public, just know I already got a video ready to drop. So if you want more, if you want more D-nasty peen, just say the word. I'll drop the video, bro. It's that easy. Know that a-hole should not been looking facts. Nothing for P.O. Just don't type hen. Oh. <laughs> Ultra. Y'all don't need to know those graphic details about me unless you really want to know. Then just slide in my DMs. I'll give you a picture. <clears throat> I'll explain it to you. I just hate when people do that. Like, if I take a pic and show you, but you start swiping, it's like, bruh, why? I took one picture. Yo, swear to God. I swear to God. Anytime I show somebody a picture and they do, and they even reach for my phone, I'm like, hey, 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 no, 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 no. There's nothing I'm showing you here that you need a pinch, zoom, or swipe for. Look right here. That's it. Nowhere else. You know what? Honestly, I don't even show niggas shit on my phone no more. If I want somebody to see something, even if they're sitting next to me, I'll text it to them like, yo, look at your phone. Like, yo, yo, look at your phone. Look at your phone real quick. I'll message you, tell you to look at it on your phone, and I'll come to your phone and be like, yo, what we, yeah, yeah, you see that shit, nigga? You see that shit, nigga? Yeah, no, nah, I'm not doing that shit. Can't blackmail this blackmail. Yo, absolutely. Yo, let them know, my boy. Fuck these hoes. Fuck these doxing ass motherfuckers. These invaders of privacy. But yeah, that's the end of the story. So that's the story of how D Nasty's peen almost ended up all over the internet, but it didn't. You nasty.